my dear children good morning to all so did you read the textbook last chapter third chapter my dear children it's a very important chapter very very important chapter uh, sometimes you will be feeling bored with that chapter but don't feel bored you have to study it nicely because so many questions can be asked from this chapter so let's begin our class so last class we were dealing with our third chapter a uh, rotation and revolution and till ocean currents and tides we were uh, taken the chapter is it so today we are moving with the uh, revolution of the earth today we are moving with the uh, revolution of the earth so before moving with the revolution of the earth last class also we were dealing with the definition of revolution for you once again i am going to give the explanation for revolution what is revolution the movement of the earth around the sun the movement of the earth around the sun on a fixed path is known as a revolution the movement of the earth around the sun on a fixed path is known as a revolution then next we are moving with the revolution of the earth in that Uh, uh, point we have to deal with different different points so listen carefully that is the first one all planets revolve around the sun how many planets are there yes eight planets are there as yes or no this all these eight planets revolve around revolve means move otherwise rotate okay revolve around the sun the second point is that it revolve in a fixed path otherwise fixed orbit from west to east from west to east then the next four point orbit of earth orbit of the earth around the sun it has a shape orbit of the earth around the sun has a shape what is that shape elliptical shape elliptical shape you have to remember the uh, malayalam term that is rat what is the malayalam term that is the word elliptical shape and the next point is that we were saying about revolution as or not it moves at a constant speed it moves at a constant speed it moves means earth moves at a constant speed of 30 km per second listen carefully earth moves at a constant speed of 30 kilometer per second and completes one revolution in 365 and 1 by 4 days so listen carefully once again i will explain for you that is a revolution means it is the movement of the earth around the sun movement of the earth around the sun on a fixed path yes or no that <clears throat> the all the planets revolve around the sun then this planets that is it revolve in a fixed path from west to east then orbit of an earth around the sun that is it moves in which shape elliptical shape the next one it moves at a constant speed of 30 km per second and it completes one revolution in 365 and 1 by 4 days 365 and 1 by 4 days and revolution of the earth cause seasons and what happened what happened for this what are after all these process this revolution of our earth finally it goes seasons is this points clear for you so before winding the class today in our class 
we were dealing with the revolution of the earth. So many points were there. We were dealing with these points. And at last, we end with the causes known as seasons. So the next class, we will be dealing with our seasons. May God bless you. Thank you.